Trust Technology Business. Thanks so much for joining us. And as we are as digital as digital gets, we press the magic button and the sun is shining in Dusseldorf. Only at a Xerox press conference. It's truly great to be back at Drupa, the Olympics of the graphic communications industry. And I think you'll see in our session today that if this is the Olympics, then hopefully you'll agree that Xerox is going to be winning a lot of gold medals. And that's important. Because if you think about the evolution of this industry over the past 25 to 30 years, Drupa is usually the landmark where the technology will take this industry. I've been watching this industry unfold and history unfold since I joined this industry in 1987 and attended my first Drupa in 1990. So this is my seventh Drupa. And it's interesting, while I feel like a 30 year old and my wife will sometimes remind me that I act like a 20 year old, when I look back at how many Drupas, there's no denying my chronological age. <laughs> and every Drupa has left a vivid impression on me. At my first Drupa in 1990, just think about it. The big technology then was lithographic film. Just think about that. I worked for a company that manufactured 100 million square meters of lithographic film. I think it's safe to say you won't be hearing much about lithographic film at this Drupa. In the mid-1990s, 1995, it was CTP or computer to plate. And then the industry truly went digital in the year 2000 at Drupa. The Xerox iGen was shown for the first time. Now 16 years later, it's well over a half a billion dollar business for us. And then 2004, as you remember, was the JDF Drupa. But more recently, we've had a string of inkjet Drupas. I joined Xerox in the year 2012, and we brought our first inkjet device to Drupa that year, our Cypress 500, with waterless inkjet technology. It's a wonderful technology, a great technology, but we certainly wanted more breadth, depth, and optionality for our customers. We knew that some of our customers preferred an aqueous solution. Based upon their input, we developed a vision of what an inkjet press could be. To achieve it, we had to accelerate our development. And one way to do that was to acquire a partner who could deliver the leadership aqueous inkjet technology that we needed. That partner was Impica, and in 2013, we acquired Impica in their strong portfolio of inkjet presses and technology. And I'm happy to say that three years later, the founder of Impica is a very, very large part of our inkjet technology and future, Paul Morgabi. So Paul, great to have you with us. <laughs> and in Drupa this week, our vision truly comes to life and very proudly. It's a vision shaped with innovation, informed most importantly by our customers and ready to take this industry to new places. We've generated a lot of excitement when we introduced our most recent two new inkjet platforms, including our first cut sheet inkjet press at Drupa Media Days in March. And we expect to generate a lot more excitement with them here at the trade show. Others on the team will be updating you on these presses and sharing our other Drupa announcements in a few moments including some that we did not spotlight at Media Days. But before they come up to speak, I want to say that when I joined Xerox four years ago, I was truly thrilled to join this company, this industry icon that is Xerox. I'm so proud to be part of this company. We are number one in most of our market segments, and we plan on staying number one through innovation. More importantly, and as importantly, we plan on serving our customers to help make them number one in their markets. There are strong growth opportunities in this industry. Capturing them takes vision. A vision for wedding the physical and the digital in innovative ways to create new solutions, new businesses, and new supply chains. Today and throughout Drupal, we're sharing our vision for succeeding in today's graphic communications market with technologies that can help our customers shape their visions for capturing this industry's growth opportunities and with automated systems that integrate elegantly to just let the work flow through their shops. And when I look back at this group in many years from now, yes, I will certainly remember the innovative inkjet technologies that we brought to market. But more importantly, I'll remember our wonderful customers who we met at Drupal, who adopted our technologies and who took the journey with us to transform their businesses. Because our customers are the real medal winners at Drupal. And now I'd like to introduce somebody who will tell you a lot more about our vision for the future. 
Someone who certainly shares my feelings about Xerox is certainly the face of Xerox, who shares my passion for the industry and for our customers. Please join me in welcoming my boss, the Xerox Chairman and CEO, Ursula Burns. Thank you very much.